Hi guys, this is a short demonstration video for the Arduino Simple FOC Shield. This is a PLDC driver uh, board shaped in, uh, in the shape of Arduino Shield um, and uh, it's intended primarily for, for field-oriented control using uh, Arduino boards. Uh, it features this um, STM L, uh, L6234 chip uh, it's a three-phase BLDC uh, BLDC motor driver, and um, it has um, it has three uh, pull-up resistors for for your encoder, uh, both for for A and B channel and the index pin. Um, you can these pull-ups you can enable from from beneath. You can solder these pads if you need them. If you don't, then uh, just just leave it as is. Um, some encoders need them. Some some encoders don't. Um, additionally, all the all the PWM pins and enables of the driver are configurable in hardware. Uh, their pinout is configurable actually, so you can choose which pins you want to use which, which, uh, with with uh, which um, with which uh, phase and PWM signal of the motor. So this this enables stackability of of this uh, sense, this um, shield. So you are going to be able to stack two of them to m actually run two. Two BLDC motors with PWM uh, with the uh, field-oriented control with this uh, with this board. Additionally, you can also choose um, choose the pinout of the encoders. Uh, as you see, for example, in my case, I chose uh, PWM A to be in pin nine, P enable to be pin eight, PWM C in pin eleven, PWM B in pin ten. Uh, encoder A3, encoder B2, and encoder index is going to be on A0, so analog 0. This board is completely open source, so you are going to be able to find uh, find uh, all the um, schematics and um, and uh, Gerber files and all the fabrication files in the GitHub repository of the simple field or simple field oriented control library, and uh, feel free to use it, extend it, uh, improve it. I, I'm looking forward to see. What can you do with it? Uh, additionally, if you are interested in the board itself, um, the fully functional versions, I'm going to also put the link into the description to my website where you are going to be able to, to buy some, uh, some test versions. So, um, let, let's test it. So uh, this is how it works. Like, uh, any other Arduino shield, you just plug it in. You stack it on the Arduino itself. You plug in the motor. I'm going to just move the motor a bit closer. You plug in the encoder. Then the power supply. This red red LED light is uh, is uh, showing the power supply. And finally, I'm going to be using the serial terminal to to set the the commands. So I'm going to use the the um, USB cable. So at the moment, the motor is. Uh, the motor is uh, initialized and it's in the angle mode so at the moment it's already holding its position as you can see and uh, since I'm not using the index pin uh, it's going to take the zero position from where where uh, from um, so its position, the, it's going to declare its zero position where it is when the Arduino is started. So it was in this position before, so this is its zero position at the moment. Uh, let's move it, uh, let's move it 90 degrees, maybe negative 90 degrees, back to zero. Let's move it uh, full circle. Back to zero. You can also move it a few circles, like five rotations. Negative five rotations is going to be ten rotations. I'm going. I'm be going to try to stop it. Yes. Okay. Let's let's go back to zero. 
then for example let's go into into the velocity mode and let's rotate it with one one radian per second maybe five radians per second or uh, negative five uh, let's go more 10 radians per second or even 20 negative 20 You can see that the motor is uh, is very reactive. It's uh, for these small motors, you can move them really fast. Uh, like Twenty radians a second to zero, it's almost uh, instantaneous. You don't know it's even moving, and you can also go as slow as one, two, three radians per second, and even slower. It depends of the the, um, the configuration of your controller, uh, PI loop, and so on. So that's it, that's it guys, that's the simple FOC shield. You can see it's very easy to set up and it's basically plug and play with this um, simple FOC library. Uh, also it's stackable so you can use two of them to, to run two motors, two BLDC motors with field oriented control on Arduino Uno. And I'm sure you can imagine many, many applications using this kind of setup. And um, it's as well uh, fully open source so you can uh, you will be able to find the all the links in the description where you can find the uh, fabrication file schematics and so on if you are interested to make one yourself if you are more interested in, in uh, buying fully assembled functional version i'm also going to put the link in the description to my website that you can find some and uh, thank you very much for watching uh, i'm really interested to see your comments and uh, and impressions about about this thing thank you